Now as we're moving down the hierarchy of important things to really crush your competition with eBay hacks, we get to description hacks and how you can write a really killer description. If you can highlight the benefits of the product to the buyer, you'll go a long way towards selling the product. See, most people talk about the features of a product, what it does. But if you talk about how this product will benefit them, what will it will do for them, how it will make them look better, feel better, do better, um, you're going to go a long way towards selling the product. When a potential customer reads your description, they're wanting to know, first of all, is this the right product for me? But just importantly, they also want to know, is this the right seller? See, they're looking at everything with an eye towards, do I want to enter into a transaction with this person? So they're looking at your images, they're looking at your description, they're looking at your terms of service, they're looking at everything, and they're making a dual decision. First decision, is this the product for me? Is it priced right? And that, that's a product decision. But the second decision really is, is this a person I want to do business with? So keep that in mind as you're doing this and as you're writing your descriptions, you want to always sound friendly and easy to work with. The other key, especially of selling a used item or a collectible, is to be totally transparent about the condition of the item. It's so important when selling a used item or a collectible item to really show all of the flaws in the item as well as all the good parts. If you have a more involved description, you'll want to use the AIDA formula that is used by top copywriters. And A stands for attention. So at the very top of your description, you want to have a headline that draws the attention. Now many people just use the title uh, at the top of their description. You, what you might want to do is use a, something similar to your title, but highlight the most important benefit that that product will bring to them. Then the I stands for interest. So then you begin to explain some of the benefits of that product and you begin to build interest in the item. The D stands for desire. Now what you're wanting to do is really pile on the benefits of getting this item and what it does for them. Really building the desire for the item. And the A is the call to action. When you want uh, at the towards the end of your description you want to let them know and if you order today you get free shipping or if you order today this item is guaranteed you know we have a 14 day return policy or whatever it is that you decide to add in as a call to action now let's talk about feedback hacks one of the most important things you can do in my opinion is highlight your positive feedback on eBay this is called social proof it's really showing your new customers what your previous customers have said about your service. It's showing that you are a great seller, you do things quickly, you ship quickly, uh, you take care of problems very quickly. Unfortunately, most people won't go and check your glowing feedback. They won't click on the feedback uh, button, they won't check it out. So why not add a screenshot of some of your feedback comments to your description, the way we did with the photo uh, added to your description earlier, right? What you can do is grab a screenshot of some of your most positive feedback comments and then put them right there towards the bottom of your description. So the first step is to get a screenshot of some of your best feedback comments. One great tool that you can use is Giazo, located at giazo.com. It's spelled G-Y-A-Z-O.com. This is a screenshot tool that allows you to take screenshots on the internet and then automatically uploads it to your Giazo account online. You could do that and then use that image to upload it to Photobucket the way I showed you earlier. And let me walk you through this by showing you another demo video and walking you through exactly how to do it. 